Instacrete helps the engineers to build an accurate 3D model at a much faster rate than the current method they are using. For the demonstration purpose, we will construct a tiny 3D model. To begin with, click on the RCC CAD tab, select the Grid tool. In the Grid Manager, we will have two horizontal grid lines spaced at 4.5 meters. Using the non-uniform option we can place grid lines at a non-uniform distance. Then we will have two vertical grid lines at 5 meters. Let us add levels to the project. Select the Level tool, add six levels at 3 meters. Non-uniform distance tool helps to place the levels at a non-uniform distance. You can use the level tool from any view. In the project browser, you will notice all the added levels. To add foundations, we will use the foundation tool. The grid column lists all the grid points. For the symmetric design, two options are provided namely, X symmetry and Y symmetry. Let us select the proper size of the foundation to place it at the relative grid intersection point. According to the project need the user can attach the data like username, phase, concrete mix and the cost to the footing. Hit the OK button to place all the foundations. The columns are added using one of the two tools. Let us use the single level column tool. In the column manager select the base level as level 1. The top level will be second level. Select X or Y symmetry according to the design need. The grid column shows all the grid points. The column base column or foundation shows the foundation size below the selected base level. Select the column size. The user can apply various offset values like top or base offset and X or Y offset. Hit the OK button to place the columns. Instacrete has given four tools to add the beams to the model. We will use Quick Beam tool. Select Level 2 for reference level, select appropriate beam sizes. The user can add offset values and add data according to the design requirement. Hit the OK button to place the beams. To add the floor to the model, select Structural Floor tool. In the Structural Floor Manager, select appropriate grid lines, the level and the floor type. Select the Flat Slab option to build a flat slab in the model. Hit OK to place the floor in the model. Ignore the warning message by hitting the OK button. We will use the Quick Wall tool to add the walls in the model. Select Level 2 as the base level for the wall. The column wall position shows the position of the wall. After selecting the wall types, hit OK to place them in the model. Instacrete uses the same dialog boxes for editing the model. Dialog boxes are used to provide data to build the model. The user is never required to work in the graphics window.